Hello and welcome. This is Rochelle from the DIY Affiliate on YouTube and the Secret YouTuber on TikTok. In this video, I am going to be showing you how to create a stitch. This is an option that TikTok offers new video creators to help them to get their foot into the influencer a stitch door. stitch is a video in which you can use five seconds of an original viral video and you can record longer than three seconds of an ending to it and make it your own video and put it up on your account to get more likes, follows, and views. In this video, I am going to show you how to create a stitch from an already viral video, a video that has many views, likes, and shares, in which you can take five seconds of that video and add 10 seconds of your own or less. The first place you want to go is to your Discover page. And here you will see all of the trending hashtags that you can possibly use. You can check out these videos and these hashtags. This Discover page is very important to you. Here you will see the trending hashtags and how many times they've been used. You can also go to your home page and check out all of the videos here and decide if you want to create a stitch from any of these videos. You want to choose a video that the TikTok algorithm has already pushed this video out. So you have more of a chance of getting more likes, more views, and more follows with a video that TikTok has already approved and has already gone viral. So I'm going to use the hashtag warped world. And you can see here how many times it's been used. 33.2 thousand times. I'm going to use this video here. And I'm going to see if I can create a stitch from it. When you look at the video, you want to see, number one, you want to see what the effect is that they're using. And you want to write down the effect. You can also click into the effect and make sure it's added to your favorites. You can also look at the hashtags, write down the hashtags that's being used and that's being used. So you will copy everything on the screen and then you click on this arrow right here. This arrow. You will see a pop-up box come up and you choose the fifth option, which is stitch. You just choose a stitch and here you will choose up to five seconds of the video. Now you can choose up to five seconds of this video and it can be anywhere. You can choose it from the middle. You can choose it from the end. You can also choose parts of the video. any place in the video up to five seconds. And then you would click on the next button. Uh, this will then bring up your recording screen and then you can choose an effect to use with your recording and you should have it in your favorites. So this is warped. You have to record more than three seconds and then your pace or you can record at a faster pace. You can use your front camera, use your back camera. Also filters. Here you can see you can use filters for portrait, landscape, food, vibe. And just by clicking into these different filters to see which one you would like to use. If you have over recorded and you want to take off part of your recording, you can choose this X. It'll say discard the last clip. And then whenever you are ready, you can use the circle with the white check mark. And this will take you your video. And now you can further add more effects. Effect. Click into the effect. You can have a visual effect. Use effects. Use transitions. Or split your screen. The way to use an effect is to slide your bar over 
click on the effect that you want, hold your finger down until you decide where you want your effect to be, click Save. This will now save your effect and it will appear where you want it to appear on your video. You can do this with either visual effects, transitions, or split. Say you want to use the time warp. Put it to where you would like your video to start and hold your finger down and click Save. To add text, down here at the bottom, you'll see Effects, Text, and Stickers. Click on Text. And here you can add your text just by simply typing it in. By simply typing it in, you can add your text, or you can use your microphone, which I am doing. Once you see, you can move it around on the screen. When you click on the Edit, you can further edit your text. Here, you can change the font. You can change the alignment of your text. And you can change the highlight colors. If you use the Enter key, you can split your text up. In the editing box, you will also see set duration and text to speech. When you choose set duration, you will notice the whole, the whole text and you want your text to appear in a certain part of your video. So you will choose where you want your text to appear. The text will appear at the minimum for one second. You can't have any less than that. However, you can have more. And it shows you. When you have finished, you will then click on the check mark. And then you will see your text show up in the area that you want it to. The text to speech will read off everything that you have typed on your screen for your text. As soon as your text comes up, it will read off what you have chosen. And in order for you to stop doing that, you need to cancel it part of your text, you will also notice you have your emojis that you can use and the emojis will appear where your cursor is. For example, if I type in these emojis here, they're going to appear in a straight line. However, I can make them bigger and you can make your text bigger or smaller. You can flip them around and put them anywhere you want on your screen. You can do the same with your text. You can make your text smaller or you can make your text bigger, smaller, bigger. Stickers, adding stickers, emojis, and GIFs. You can search for any type of uh, sticker. Or, whoops, if you're looking for eyes. Anything that you're looking for, you can type search bar. And you can also use the stickers that appear here simply by clicking into any sticker and it will appear on your screen. You can make it bigger, smaller, move it around. And also a very important thing is set the duration. So you want, you want it to appear at a certain part in your stitch. And remember it has to appear for one second. Choose a check mark when you're done. You can also use an emoji, and the emoji is the same thing. Bigger, smaller, move it around. Set the duration to where you want your emoji to appear. And choose a check mark. You can also do a voiceover by simply pushing down and talking into your microphone. And you can also make the volume louder or lower for your audio and also the added sound as well. Then when you're done, you would then click on the square red box that says next. 
you that the original creator has been credited and your video has been stitched together. And here you can further add your hashtags. You can add your effect hashtag, which is warped world broad hashtag, such as the same as you saw on your stitch, which was for me, it's cats of TikTok. And hashtag cats. And plus, I use my clipboard and I also have other descriptions in which I saved for Mr. Tiger Cat. You can create your own hashtags to use. You can create your hashtag and add it. To add for the For You page and select a cover. And you want to select a cover that has movement in it. And select a call to action button. Choose save. And now you're ready to post or add to your drafts. In your settings, you want to see who can watch this video. And you do have a choice. Everyone, friends, or only me. Allow comments. Allow duet. Allow stitch. Save to the device. If you have a profile and you've optimized your profile, you can share to your Instagram by clicking on your post. So I hope this has been helpful to you. If you found this short video helpful, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you'll be notified of the next video that I am posting. And follow me on TikTok at The Secret YouTuber. If you have a YouTube channel and you would like me to put you in the featured channel section of my main channel, then leave me a message so that I can go to your channel and get the information that I need to enter you into the featured section. Thank you for watching. Stay safe and have a wonderful evening.